Hello, everyone. RBG Kim Kid here, back with a new live stream of Black Myth Wukon. How y'all doing today? Hope y'all having a good week starting off so far. Uh, my week's been okay, I suppose. Uh, I had to stay long at work yesterday for uh, a little politics going on. But, ah, uh, well. I'll get a little extra in the paycheck this uh, next week. So, that's good. But yeah, guys, I am streaming Black Myth Wukong. I've actually been very excited for this game ever since it was announced. I'm like, ooh, that's fun. Um, um, so yeah, it's one of those games that it's definitely something that's like, oh, it got announced. It's like cool. And then kind of like fell off the face of the plant for a while. Then it came back up and it's like, oh, sweet. So yeah, I'm very excited for this game. Um... I know I think a lot of people said it's like going to be Dark Souls-ish, but then I think like early gameplays showed that it's not. Um, it might be, it, it might have like similarities to like still, I see a lot of people um, somewhat comparing it to Stellar Blade and Lies of P in a way, which is A-OK, -okay, because I actually really enjoyed both of those games too, and ha having to get another one of these games in the same year that we got Stellar Blade. Uh, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm very excited for this. Um, but yeah, um... The one thing I will say that I'm not a big fan of is the fact that, like, if you got this game physically, you don't get a disc with it. Um, for now, anyway. I think that's something they plan to, like, maybe do in, like, December or something like that. And I, I, I somewhat get it because, you know, it's a entirely new team or a new uh, company and such. <laughs> Which I think is the same story. I know it's the same story with Stellar Blade. Um, Stellar Blade, that was definitely a new, the new company's whatever's, uh, first game. I don't know if that's the same for Lies of P, though. Either way, I'm, I'm glad both of those had physical releases and such. Um, but, I, I mean, this technically does have a physical release. It's just, again, no disc, which, again, is weird, but what can you do? But, all right, guys, as you all know, I live stream every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday at 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. Go roughly for three hours, maybe a little more. Maybe a little less. It all kind of depends on what is uh, currently happening on that day. Currently, guys, I am live streaming now. Black Myth Wukong. But I'm also streaming Elden Ring, Shadow of the Air Tree. And I'm also streaming Final Fantasy XIV Dawn Trial. Uh, we should, if everything goes according to plan, knock on wood. Um, and you know, I don't spend the three hours just getting my ass handed to me. Because I am literally outside of the final boss area in Elden Ring. So I would pray that the next uh, live stream of Elden Ring on Thursday, that's probably going to be the finale. Since, like I said, I'm already at the final boss. So I would assume that hopefully it won't take me over three hours to beat him. Although I think that was the case with... Uh, Radagon for the final boss in the main game it took me over three hours as well so we'll see but yeah and of course in Final Fantasy 14 as well we're getting some good stuff there too I have a feeling we're getting I have a feeling there's going to be like either two or three streams left of 14 since we have roughly like 30 some MSQ so but yeah very excited for that so it's nice to have a new story so all right let's do it new journey so I've been keep, I've been mostly, you know, uh, keeping myself. Um, I've been not really following along to some of the stuff that they've been saying or doing. It's it's it's, they, it's basically a whole like yeah no I'm gonna pick up this game so let me do that. Yeah, you know, Journey to the West inspiration for this game. Pretty cool. On this cloud.
Hello. My master. <laughs> Safe. The scriptures. Sound. All I ever wanted was a life in my mountain. Free from you and your so-called merits. Those high above don't trust me. I understand that. I just thought that was just a little bit bigger. And they send you and those knuckleheads to threaten me. To obey and serve once more. <laughs> I understand that too. But what I don't understand is... You bastards killing my kind! not just any monkey. He's a monkey of merit. A monkey was made Buddha once. None other than me can challenge him to a duel. Look, monkey. I don't make a habit of fighting someone I've bested before. Here's my offer. If you lose, I'll take you to the Celestial Court. They will stay and level your mountain. But if I lose, I shall certainly take revenge, and they will level your mountain nonetheless. Hmm. How tragic would that be, huh? You are one of the court. We don't need to resort to violence. How about you bend the knees, admit the wrongs, and we can put this behind us? <laughs> All these years, except for that pig, you're the one who talks the tallest tales. Good, I am entertained. Speaking of entertainment, wouldn't it be fun if I pluck your extra eye out for my snack and allow you to keep the other two? Because I'd hate to let you miss how I'll slaughter each mongrel of the court. Those below, those above, and that black mutt of yours. Damn, this Coming. is a good opening. All of you. They gave you many chances. Yet you spurned each one. Such ingratitude. Oh, my God. 
Nice. The victorious fighting Buddha. Have you any idea how many would give their everything for immortality? Immortality? <laughs> for that word, all realms and beings have ruined themselves. <laughs> Court welcomed you, foul monkey, yet you remain untamed. None shall save you now. <laughs> Dear brother, your edge needs homing. Good. I was in need of a back scratcher. <laughs> The stuff that happens down there, I think it is. This definitely feels like this is like the final battle. Or like leading up to what the final battle would be while well, everything else would be the lead up for it. It's my toenail. Rat! You call that a duel? The glare up here is dazzling. Fight me in the woods if you have the guts. Oh. 
And so ends the last tale of Sun Wukong. A hero who treasured his freedom above all else. Buddhahood he attained, yes, but cumbersome he found the celestial rules, for he yearned to come back and to revel in the simple joys with us. Little did he know, his choice to forgo the life above only fueled their mistrust. <sighs> this stone has stood for countless days on the mountain. Since my youth, they said that his remains lie within it. <laughs> Unbegotten, undying, such is the nature of a stone monkey. A stone his monkey. body was broken, his spirit endures. Into six relics he turned, and separately they escaped, choosing to stay hidden. Those are the six senses of the great sage. Yet no one has ever seen them, not in centuries. I'm old now. Venture through all the lands, I cannot. Mm. Yet among you, there might be one who is destined. One that shall recover all his scattered relics. And upon the return of the relics to Mount Tuago, he may yet rise again. Black Myth Wukong. Chapter 1 Black Cloud, Red Fire. Home is behind. Oh, do I have to hit? Oh, no, it's loading. On the gold bend the toll life of human or for gold. Nowhere better than a home. We to death and ever grow. Huh? Here, yeah. you see what bliss my face well, shows. Well, well. <laughs> Luck's around the corner. Seems like he just fell from a fruit Ooh, yes. tree here. Perfect timing. This peach knew I needed a snack. <laughs> you sneaky rascal! Dad, fool me! I'll make sure you regret it! <laughs> How many times you come around, you're still as mischievous as ever, eh? Wolf Scout, Wolf Swordsman. Can I get the... Where is the... It doesn't really have me to change anything. Okay, equipment, self-advance. Seek guidance from the deities. Better to steer your own path. Charting scriptures and better.
Oh, that guy weapon. Don't have any sparks. Is this, this does play pretty well. Oh, I don't know what I just did with R1 there. Or L. L. L1. will so that's like my progress bar up there so charge heavy attacks Tr hold to charge to build up focus hold heavy attack to charge charge up cost down but quickly builds up focus Oh, is that like my oh, what, save? What you waiting for? Pluck your hair and make an offer. Hey, hey, wait! Hi. Keeper of Black Wind Mountain have long been waiting for your arrival. Oh, his spitting image, I'd say. Up ahead is Guan Yin Temple. Once it was bustling with worshippers. Before it was ruined by that fire. Ah. Then the temple was rebuilt. Oh, what good is it to rebuild a temple if the goodwill of men has been burnt to ashes? You've forgotten this place, but they haven't forgotten you. Oh, that's a tough one. Good luck to you. All righty. Our conditions or punish your guards, enemies will also respawn. Travel instantly to any keeper's shrine where incense has already been offered and take a rest. Collect gifts. <sighs> Old guard. And trail blazing scarlet gorge. Strength rules yield your seat. I'm a hero. Trailblazer's feet. Human de delegates through rare. Don't compare to the mountain monkey's carefree air.
When the gourd is full, the first sip replenishes to full HP. Coconut wine. Each sip restores 33% of maximum HP. Oh, that's pretty cool. Insane te trial talisman. Here the talisman shall immediately free the soul from the body and guide it back to the last keeper shrine visited for resurrection. Perhaps some trade can be done at the keeper shrine. Crafting. I think it has like the the same um was it supposed to be my guard or something? I wish I knew what that was. Um I think it has the is there like a map? Uh, but I wish it had, I, I think it, oh, hello. Okay, so yeah, like I, 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 like I was saying, I think this has like the same. I feel like this has like the same in terms of like level up as Sekiro does in the way that like you level up to get your skill points and then your skill points is what you use.
Thanks, old man. Oh, oh. It's been a while, but the immobilized spell still works like a charm. <laughs> Since you hail from Mount Huaguo, it won't hurt to teach you a handy trick. Now, here we go. Give me your hand. Immobilize. A simple hand gesture can bind the enemy in place. There you go. Should you come across any miscreants, just point your finger at them and release this spell. You'll be able to hold them in place while giving yourself a breather. Sadly, mine is but a humble trick. Its power will wear off within a few short moments. Though it's good enough against boneheads like this one. Anyway, just consider it an ace up your sleeve. No! The young wise these days know no manners! Fear not! Teach him a lesson with your new spell! Self-advance and sparks. Uh, start open self-advance to awaken talents. Level up to gain sparks and awaken more abilities and spells. Sparks will not be lost upon resurrection. Yep, basically what I thought. It's, it is basically like Sekiro in a way where you don't lose the skill points, but you lose the build up to the skill point. I love like the, the 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 portraits for the enemies here. That's really cool. Stagnation. Hitting an immobilized enemy with light attacks slightly extends the duration of the next immobilization effect upon them. This effect stacks up to five times. Each talent level moderately increases damage dealt to immobilized enemy. That's not a bad one right there. What about this one? Each talent level slightly increases the health recovered upon consuming focus point. Enables sprinting while charging. Perform heavy attacks during light combo attacks while with a focus point consumed what also all uh, the destined one to ex execute resolved strike uh during resolve strike the de destined one ca can see through the incoming enemy attacks and nullify their damage enemies that have been through enemies have been through are easier to stagger and foundation each talent level moderately reduces stamina cost for sprinting dodging uh, increase the engage distance for light attack stagger starter. Moving forward while using staff spin, initiate mobile spin. The dust one hit spins his staff around his body to deflect projectiles. Okay, so that just reflect re deflects projectiles. Uh, increases maximum health, increases maximum stamina. Let us get uh, level up the health, a spark of thought. And it sparks your talents more than a spark of thought. And let's reduce the stamina, take them all dodging. I think that's good right there. This is gonna. Well, then again, this game does have multiple endings, like some, uh, like basically every other. Hmm. <sighs> Uh, 
Like this game probably has. Oh, it doesn't probably. It does have multiple endings. I saw that, uh, that it does. Well, not saw, but I read that it does. Um. Gadar of form. the animations of like when you try to drink something but then it's empty and they're like ow I wonder if this will be like Um, I wonder if this will be like Sekiro or like other like uh, games where you can't where you don't go to New Game Plus right away. And I wonder if this is like I wonder if the New Game Plus for this will be like you know it does get harder as well. So I don't know how many endings there are, and I don't know which ending we'll go for or how to even get it, but we'll uh, we'll figure it out. Welcome to my no death run. We are go definitely gonna beat this game without dying. Just ignore that my health is totally low, so. The health is low, but that does not mean I died. Because I didn't. It's beautiful, and it's fun so far, so I'm liking it. I am liking it. Actually, I think what's actually helping is the fact that the enemies do get staggered. Man shrieks at odor but smells of beauty, which is only natural. Once hidden inside the Buddha's head, this treasure has a secret yet to be revealed. Um,
Barber. Forest of Wolves. What happens the well as the well they attack extend the immobilization during and massively increases the damage the enemy takes. Alright, at least I got some health back. I didn't get any gourd back, but that's oh well. So I think this will be taking me to a... Yep, here we go. Choose spells you want to use in combat. Reignite the sparks. Evil repellent medicine month. Upon use, considerably increases damage reduction for a long time. Uh, upon use, instantly removes burnt state and significantly increases burn resistance. Poison, poison state. <sighs> Rest for a bit. There we go. I don't think you can just parade in, do you? It's not that simple. <sighs> Let me transform you into a golden cicada so you may follow the fires ahead and scout this mountain unnoticed. Fly! <laughs> It might be humble, cicada. but my shrine is very versatile. You'll get it soon. A golden cicada. In the depths of Black Wind Mountain, there are secrets galore. The cicada form may help you explore, but be wary. This yeah. form does not I last just for long. Long. Should you find yourself lost, just left. follow my voice. Now, off you go. Monk is roaming again. Rest won't come easy tonight. Oh, that's a big motherfucker. Okay, then.
report to Lord Lingshi. I'm just gonna ignore him for now, especially since I don't have full drinks. Increase maximum focus points from one to two. Spend more sparks to awaken. Switch the pillar stance up allows the one to support himself with his staff and ascend to its top by holding heavy attack square. Avoiding ground attacks in the process. The more focus point he builds, the higher he perches. If the staff is hit by the enemy while per perching, more sound will be consumed to maintain balance. There are Yeah, this one. And it's still not great, but it's better than standing not being able to move in general, but Hello. Okay, I've been up here. Oh, I just realized I didn't talk about the... I just realized I haven't said that I release videos every single day as well at 11 a.m. or 1... 
at 11 a.m. or 8 a.m. Central Standard Time if it's the day that I'm streaming. Uh, currently, guys, uh, Cat Quest 2 is currently the slot that's being taken over. So, fun game. Having a great time with that game. Hope you guys are enjoying that series as well. So. I mean, we just got to the second part today, but yeah. I have been recording the, uh... I have been recording, uh, the stuff for the next, uh, for the Shim uh, for SMT5 Vengeance. So I've been recording that stuff, um... It is, uh... Go along smoothly. Um, let's increase our stamina just a little bit. Yeah, stamina this time. Okay, have I explored every location save for where Big Baby is at? How do I get my MP back? How dare you interrupt my meditation? So I can see where my progress is at for this shit. I'll go rest because I only need to fight three, possibly four enemies before getting to him. So. It's not that big of a...
Ah, if I lose half, if I lose half, let's do this. Get that run back, big, bad baby. Okay. That's fine. With me. Hold the line. Wait, do I not lose anything upon death? That progress bar is still the same spot as it was last time, so. Interesting. I'll try it one more time. I'll try it one more time.
Alrighty. Sorry, my... I just got sent a link to the video about backyard sports. You guys remember, like, back in the day, there's these, like, back, like you know, backyard football, backyard uh, baseball and stuff like that. Uh, apparently, those aren't making a comeback. So, um... Yeah, no, I'm all for that. <laughs> Alright, let's, uh... Health. Hey, baby. Okay, I'm not counting that one. That one sucks. This is the only enemy that has ever killed me. And it's going to stay that way. This is the only enemy that will kill me. No other enemy will kill me. Uh, this will be a no-death run of uh, Black Myth Wukon. By the way, like, you know, like, very ambitious for, like, you know, a first-time game developing studio or whatever. Be like, hey, like, this is, like, going to be... Like, this is, like, just our first game in the Black Myth series, which is pretty cool, by the way, because, you know, it's going to be all about, like, you know, Chinese uh, mythologies, like Wukong, like some Wukong and all that stuff, so that's pretty cool. really like that, so. All right, big baby. Ow. Yo, damn it. Alright, we're done with him. We're done with him. So I don't want you guys to, you know, keep saying, uh... Well, I don't know if the, I don't know if the whole backyard sports thing is uh, like a show or something or if it is a game or whatever. Report to the 
All right, let's see who whose meditation we interrupted. Well, this definitely looks like a boss. Hmm, another monkey, I see. Why don't you lay down your weapon and join me in goodness mercy? What say you? Hey, you, you want to like dodge? That sucks. Red Tides spells. As the feral flurry intensifies with each fierce thrust, the flames do rise. Transforms into a wolf guy and inflicts Scorch Bane on the enemy with each attack. Transformation. Weapons and valuable cherished, valuable cherished by your guys offered carry lingering, lingering obsessions from the dis deceased owners collecting them grants the ability to briefly take on their forms in combat each transformation has its own strength make them worth exper make them worth experimenting with might transformations continuously consume might and require full gauge to initiate using spells during transformation further depletes might and once it is fully depleted the transformation occurs automatically subsequently might will gradually can recover
Oh, I need two sparks for that. Each time level moderately increases the damage of the next attack after a perfect dodge. You just had to make some noise, did you? Now everyone knows you're here. When a chime so grand echoes in the forest, Yao Guais will surely be alarmed. Hmm. I wonder if that changes. I wonder if that like will change like my ending, depending on if I rang that bell or not, or if it's one of those things that I was forced to do that anyway. So. Um, okay, now where do I go? I probably have to go that way where that big baby's at, don't I? I know it's not a baby, I just like calling it big baby. This might, maybe I'll be able to beat the big baby now. No heal.
Oh, you... Oh, God damn it. Okay, I think I I think I can figure out how to do this. Obviously, don't go into it right away like I did. Basically, do what I was somewhat doing at that in that attempt that I just did. I'll try one more time with the setup and then I'll just run past him without getting noticed, which seems to be somewhat easy to do. Oh my god!
That one doesn't count. Oh, you fucking bitch! Yeah, we're moving on. Wolf Sentinel. Okay. Shh, keep quiet. You 
don't want to set off that beast. In the backyard is Black Wind Gwai's ally, calls itself Ling Schutzer. Considering your strength, I suggest you oh, get away while you can, little monkey. Craft armor. Sprinting each second moderately increases attacks. This effect can stack up to 10 times and will cease upon stopping. Get away while you can, little monkey. Stop. Hmm. Once you pass that gate, there's no turning back. Well, what else am I supposed to do? Oh, that's like a werewolf bear box thing.
we go. Yaguai King. Now that it's dead, you might as well take a good look around. A great pill, the Black Wind Guai had gifted the wolf. Fight would be a deserving reward for that fight. Inflicts considerable or more damage bonus on enemies at critical health. So when I have more critical health or... The mighty employ their corporeal forms as furnaces and their essence, vigor, and spirit as ingredients to forego a potent core which may be harnessed to craft celestial medicines. I got nothing in terms of like sparks though. Or did I? Oh well. Celestial Jade Lotus Pill, Celestial Medicines, a miraculous pill concocted by the god of longevity in the southernmost reaches of the land that massively increases maximum health. Ooh, yeah, that, that is a good boost, I'd say. I wonder if I'll get a new weapon at some point. I have a feeling I will. doesn't prey on travelers like you. You don't look like a Yaguai from Hi these there. parts. Uh, have you come to earn the Blackwind King's favor? Uh, hear me. That bear 
is but a hollow shell. He can grant you nothing. Don't waste your time on him. He lies about cheating death and even the treasures. His followers are, all of them, deceived. Blackwind Gwai is a sly one. He preaches virtue with a heart full of greed. Oh, I wouldn't entrust him with my plea. I don't know why you are here, but you should be vigilant. Now, I'm pressed for time. Fare thee well, then. No more? Ah, at least the good news is they're like, hey, we're, we're done talking. Oh, meditation spot. Meditate! What do these do? If these are a way to increase my MP, that's cool, but as far as I can tell, I couldn't tell from the first one, but... Oh yeah, they give me a spark, that's right. That's right, they give me a spark. Oh, what should I do? I'll be honest, I don't, I'm not entirely sure what this is. Perform heavy attack during light attack combo with a focus point consume allows the... Oh, okay. Okay. This is no goat. My shield. I gotta learn how to time my immobilizations better, because uh, that's the second time I had him. I had it timed where the enemy was not in reach of my attacks, so I was able to hit him during for the big swing. But still, during the wolf fight that we had, where that happened the first time, that's that was not ideal. So I definitely just gotta pay more attention to make sure they're on the ground when I do that. Snakehead mushroom.
I was about to say, which way? How do I get up there? And this is how. Oh, am I close to another rest spot? Big boy, yo. Long bound by worldly cage, now free in nature's safe. Hmm. Hello. Have you seen those nameless souls adrift on your path? Their wheels float aloft, never to fade. Shame, your god serves little purpose, and mine answers solely to me. Hmm. I know a way to guide the souls, mend their paths, and set them free. It will aid you. Hmm. This is better. This gourd, though humble, may save the lost, banish their obsessions, and guide them. Under the guidance of a wise master, the Destined One has mastered the art of spirit absorption. The Gord possesses remarkable divine capabilities, allowing it to absorb the lingering wills, or the lingering wills of spirits left behind by formidable Yar guys who have been defeated. For one as destined as you, there can be no turning back. We are like tumbleweeds, drifting through life, with a destiny beyond our grasp. Fair sights fade, but with ink I bid them stay. The road has claimed you, now you must see it through. Your heart will guide you further. We shall meet again. Fair sights fade, the road has... 
Your heart will... this poison to stay on for When Kui is full, press R2 and R2, L2, R2 and L. That's weird that they have R2 first, where it's usually L2, whatever. Uh, to launch spirit skills. Transform into a powerful Yaogai to unleash their signature ability, cost Kui, which can be recovered by absorbing it from enemies during combat. Spirits of Yaogai can be cultivated at the Keeper's Shrine to harvest their spirit skills. Uh, 
Oh, uh, that one, that one enemy that I have not yet beaten is also gonna, is the Yagwai chief. That doesn't seem to be the way to go, so... Okay. Okay. Got poison. Great. Love that for me. I feel like that's the way that I'm supposed to go, but there's so many other places here.
shit. I have no more magic. That's not good. I didn't even know that was like another way down here. I didn't even think about that. Oh well. Should my demise come by your hands, please pass this message to my master. Searching for deity, mortals do aspire. Craving immortality, Yao Guai's surely will conspire! Fuck me. All's in vain. Save your own effort. If I had a uh, if I was able to freeze them, I definitely would have beaten that fight. Do I have any sparks? I have two.
boys! Keep him! You cocksucker! Oh, I guess there's fall damage. Betted Elder Jinja to burn the great sage and tongue monk alive. That's these two. I thought they were already turned into ashes by that fire. Who would have thought they had turned into Yaogwais? Ring the bell. After the bell rang, it seems as though the resentment in the depths of the mountain has grown. 
Ah, forget it. Overthinking won't help. Your presence has already made a mess in the mountain. Why not go ahead? Take them out, once and for all. I don't know why I took a sip when I'm going to be resting here anyway. Self-advance. Blood of the Iron Bull. I think I probably just pick which one I want in the menu. All right. Yeah, I just pick which one I want in here. Ah, let's equip this one for now. Okay. Onward. Eyes are nothing to fear. Snake gall steeped in drink, though, makes a fine tonic to flush malady. Here, here, young friend. Be my guest inside. Take your one more monkey from Mount Huaguo. Uh, I've met many of you. On the rank of birth, you all ought to call me forefather. <laughs> but I'm just an old monkey, banished to the mortal world. Uh, I brought treasure troves down to this rowboat. Uh, 
have a look if something catches your fancy. Fight, but not without a gourd that suits just right. Coconut wine recovers more health upon using the gourd. Using the gourd moderately increases of poison resistance for a short duration. For a brief moment after using the gourd, slowly recovers a small amount of HP. Okay, well, you know what? Fine, I'll buy that. <laughs> Think of it as me earning a drink or two. Fresh brew in an old casket. My, it's there of a great task. So the time, down a few mouthfuls in one go. It's delightful. So it seems like the trophy descriptions are not going to be like cut and dry. It won't be like, oh, do this specific thing. It'll straight up be like, ah. It'll be a uh, mm. Hailed bird, hailed bird, what dimmed your shine? Past's grip beyond our grasp, the future we may still clasp. Late is the hour, young one, in which you choose to stain my tranquil abode. Pray tell, to what end do you seek?
Using my, uh, hmm. I have my R2, L2 skill will now, I don't know how much damage that will do, but I should do something. Maybe I'll do that first. I, have, I was about to say, I probably have to face him in this first phase again. Come on.
There we go. No ill will, I bear. I'm merely my brother's eyes and ears. I feign my loyalty to guard this path on the bear's order. Your destiny's bleak and stark. In its grip, we share the mark. The Guanyin Temple now lies in cinders, yet the Elder Soul endures. The root of greed ever fosters the stem of suffering. <sighs> Better to forget the thing you truly seek. The three bells. Have you seen them all? Do you too desire that which they ceaselessly hold dear? The bells. Three bells were set in the mountains since the Black Wind Guire's return, yet no one is allowed to go near them. Maybe the bells have something to do with the temple's burning. His words sound like truth to me, little monkey. Stay sharp. And keep a lookout. <laughs> Session. A remnant of worldly ties transforms the unfinished aspirations into spaces both tangible and ether ethereal, real, and illusionary. Though certain objects, one can navigate these spaces, engaging with the past and future, and perhaps gaining even more. Ah. Okay, I was about to say, you better give me full shit. Twin Serpent Staff. Don't have enough will. My only increases the damage of light combo attack finishers. The effects of massively enhance the fighting in water. In water. Massively reduce stamina cost when in water. Also does give you a better shit, but when health is low, slowly recovers a small amount of health if and why the effect is enhanced. I'd use my I would lose my moderately increased sprint speed and also in sprinting each attack. Moderately increases attack. Uh, for now, let's keep it as is.
Did I just get enough will to possibly level up my uh, weapon? Did. <sighs> nope, not quite. Still need less than five thousand or five hundred. I mean, five hundred. Great, big baby. Oh, thank Mitchaba. Oh, 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 finally, then the three bells sang. Disciples come, I hear travelers approaching my temple carrying new treasures. <laughs> well, I cannot see you, but I recognize your odor. Now give it
Ow. There we go. Ooh, that was a close one. Temple of Taint. <laughs> Two hundred and seventy years spent. <laughs> Kasaya's collected by the hundreds. <sighs> Still one short without his. Stop, stop, stop. That's right. Leave it. Just leave it. Stop the fire. Oh, brought me back here. <clears throat> Fireproof mantle, that soul. Let everything else burn. I care for nothing but my master. Give it to me quickly. The fireproof mantle. The great sage borrowed it from Virapaxa. How did it end up here? You must have freed that miserable soul. Oh, such is it. A tragedy prologued by a simple glance. It's getting late. Let's hurry up the mountain. Okay. R2 and L, huh? What does that do? I have four sparks. Each talent level slightly reduces the might decay while transformed. Uh, each talent level slightly increases might recovered speed. When Kui is full, press R2 and L to use vessels. Some hidden vessels le left by the predecessors can be discovered in the journey, each with unique powers. Using them costs Kui, which can be recovered from hitting the enemies. For a short duration after activation, grants burn immunity and gradually increases focus. Highly effective in specific environments and against specific enemies.
If I can get to my next resting spot, maybe I'll go try to beat the big baby that we that I couldn't beat beforehand. Let's see if I can beat him now. And plus, I should be able to also upgrade my my staff. Meditation spot, or is this where I gotta go? Both, or no, not both. Uh, it's just a meditation spot. Celestial Taya Pill. A miraculous pill crafted by King Father of the East of the Mountain of Fang, saying that it increases maximum mana. Ooh, nice. It. That's all the meditation slots in this area. I found all the lesser Yao Ki. There's in one character and Three kings. I love when OBS disconnects. Bronze Monkey Mask deals additional damage to the enemy upon crashing their immobilization. Upon crashing the immobilization of the enemy, massively reduce the cooldown for immobilization spell. That's not bad. Hmm. 
I do not have enough silk for it all, though. So I'll hold off on that, but I do want to upgrade my weapon. Yeah, it does. It's more fitting to be in water for that, but that's fine. Oh, that just shows me where he's at. Okay. That's where I'm at. Um. Right here is where that big baby's at. That's not what I wanted. There we go. Okay. Let's see if we can go beat Big Baby. Oh, he's not here anymore. What the fuck? Ah. Damn it. That sucks, because I knew for sure I probably would be able to beat him if I was able to fight him now. Black wind five hundred years. I have rebuilt the temple. Now it's grander in scope. All those monks consumed by the fire turn to wandering ghosts roaming in Black Wind Mountain. It was I who granted them eternal repose. Repose. I have even restored the charred scriptures piece by piece. <laughs> but oh yes, I always knew. One day you shall return. <laughs> Black 
Piece of shit. Like yeah, guy keen, black wind keen. I never see the guy clearly at night. Who can't swan? Okay. No, no, no. I'm back. Um, sorry, I had a phone call. And not really you the best time to take it, but. Yeah. but. Yeah, so yeah, game's calm. Yeah, um, Borderlands 4 just got announced. That's cool, I suppose. I don't know. I'm not. I don't mind the Borderlands games, but. Oh, you bastard! That's all you're capable of. Show your hand. God damn it! Who do you think you are to lay claim to my belongings?
They announced something else in, with the DLC for um um for the for the episode I guess for reload. There's a challenge battle. Why so little <laughs> die when you could walk away? Some cheap tricks. Meet me at the summit if you dare. <laughs> the spell he just cast may appear intricate, but it's not hard to learn. But Black Bear's expertise is lacking. Serving Guan Yin didn't help him much. But what he left here could surely help us. Consider today your lucky day. <laughs> ah! Cloud Steep. Dispersing into mist allows for an escape and provides an opportunity to execute an un un unveiling strike. And disperse illusions traversed. You still have a lot to learn, but give yourself time. <laughs> Marley increases defense, hell yeah. Marley increases movement speed in Cloud Steep. Each talent level considerably increases the maximum health of the decoy. Uh, increases the critical hit chance of an arriving strike, which strikes stacks per second while the cloud step. This effect can stack up to 10 times. Each down level extends the duration.
Okay. Alrighty. Well, guys, I think this is probably a good spot to end this stream here. I am really liking this game. This game's fun as hell, and I am definitely going to continue playing it. So thank you all so much for watching this stream. We'll watch it live to archived here on YouTube. Um, I will be back with uh, Black Myth Wukong on Tuesday, but I'll be here with the possible finale of Elden Ring on Thursday, and then we're back with some more Final Fantasy XIV Dawn Trial on Saturday. So I hope you guys are all looking forward to it because I know I am. But anyway, guys, like I said, yeah, thank you for watching the stream. Um, I'm liking this game a lot, and I can't wait to keep playing more of it. Um, I think I'll slowly start to understand the gameplay a little bit better once I, you know, get more into it and such. But I am liking it a lot. So, yeah. So, again, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in the next stream of next week, Tuesday. All right, guys, take care, and I'll see you guys then. Bye-bye. <laughs>